एस के खाजा वर्सेज स्टेट ऑफ महाराष्ट्र द प्रेजेंट केस हैज बीन प्रेजेंटेड बिफोर द सुप्रीम कोर्ट ऑफ इंडिया बाय द एपलेंट हु इज ऑल्सो द अक्यूज द अपील हैज बीन प्रेफर्ड बाय द एपलेंट अगेंस्ट द ऑर्डर ऑफ द बॉम्बे हाई कोर्ट विच हैड कन्विक्टेड द एपलेंट concurrently under section 307 and 332 of the indian penal code sentencing him to imprisonment of 5 and 2 years respectively so let's move forward and have a look at the facts of the case the accused had allegedly assaulted a police constable by hasti and he intended to do so on his head but the police constable dodged the blow and was injured on his right shoulder the contention raised by the appellant in the appeal were that even if the prosecution had proved the case in totality against the accused the injuries suffered by the police constable were simple in nature and would not fulfill the ingredients of section 307 ipc the contention raised by the appellant in the appeal were that even if the prosecution had proved the case in totality against the accused the injuries suffered by the police constable were simple in nature and would not fulfill the ingredients of section 307 ipc the supreme court dismissed the appeal and observed in this case The Supreme Court made the following observations that merely because the injuries sustained by the complainant were very simple in nature that would not absolve the appellant that is the accused in the present case from being convicted for the offence under section 307 of the Indian Penal Code what is important is an intention coupled with an overt act committed by the appellant In the instant case it was proved by the evidence that the accused had tried to assault the complainant with gupti and that too on his head such an overt act on the part of the appellant would be covered by the offence punishable under section 307 of the Indian Penal Code 